Would you say you're a good and safe driver? You most likely are. We generally are. Still, sometimes life gets the better of us and our attention goes off track. Traditionally, Volvo Cars has focused on getting its cars to better understand what's happening outside the car to help protect the people inside. But the inside matters just as much. Because just as how you drive can affect how you feel, how you feel can also affect how you drive. And when not feeling at your best, you may be a less safe driver. So, how to break new ground in protecting people? Well, it's all about you, the driver. We need to understand driver attention better. To do that, we will start reading the interior environment of the cabin. And that is why we're introducing a driver understanding system in the EX90, a standard. It will allow for a deeper understanding of when a driver is distracted, sleepy, or even intoxicated. Basically, when the driver's mind is leaving driving behind. So, how can we tell? Our in-house research shows that there are specific eye gaze patterns when the driver is drowsy, distracted or intoxicated. When you're alert and attentive and just driving, you spend about 80% of the time with your eyes on the road ahead and 20% elsewhere. This level of attention is something that naturally varies a bit up and down during the drive, but normally stays within certain boundaries. If the 80% goes a little above 90, we have what is called a gaze concentration effect. And gaze concentration can be a sign of cognitive distraction, such as when thinking hard about something else than driving. It can also be a sign of alcohol intoxication. In the other direction, if the normal 80% drops below 60, we know that's a sign of visual distraction, such as when a driver is texting and therefore shifts between looking at the phone and at the road ahead. By using clever algorithms for real-time sensing of gaze patterns, we can tell when a driver's focus goes off track. For added accuracy, we've opted for a two-camera driver understanding system so we can maximize detection from different angles. This new level of understanding will allow us to intervene when needed and only when needed. So, how can we intervene based on this new level of understanding? Well, we can alert you, the driver, or we can ask the car to intervene in various ways that help a safe outcome, such as by reducing speed, keeping you in lane, or by braking to a complete stop. What we do exactly will, of course, depend on the situation, but the general idea is to put a preventive shield of safety in place that's always ready to help keep driving safe. It will help you remain a good driver when needed and otherwise stay out of the way. Having a reliable driver understanding system that works hand in hand with our advanced exterior sensing will help Volvo cars break new ground toward improved safety and later to introduce unsupervised autonomous driving. <laughs>